Amen. Amen. Strong Tower is a group of people with the same idea, with the same mindset, who has come together to shape on the leadership challenges in the world. Amen. Amen. I think that deserves an applause. Amen. <laughs> Amen. 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 It's a group of people with the same ideology, the same mindset, coming together to shape on the leadership challenge in the world. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Praise God. Amen. And what better place to start from the house of God? Mm. Amen. Amen. So this first program we're going to be having is called Standing Up. Amen. Amen. So we are going to be speaking to ourselves how we can stand up. Amen. Amen. In the body of Christ. How we can stand up as leaders, how we can stand up as individuals in our race for life. Yes. Amen. Before I go further, I would like to appreciate our mommy, mommy, prophetess, Moji Party. Praise the Lord. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. She flew in all the way from London for this program. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God bless you, man. Yeah. I also like to appreciate my elder brother, Pastor Jerry Okoji. Let's put our hands together for him. Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. I would like to appreciate our own special apostle, <laughs> Apostle Linda Edwards. Fire, fire. Fire, fire. Amen. Amen. I would like to appreciate our host. Yes. Our, our, our director. Amen. The father of the house, Reverend McDonald. Amen. I also would like to appreciate the presence of Pastor Oluwatosin. Amen. Amen. From City of Life to Delaware. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Sir. God bless you. Amen. I would also like to appreciate my own very special half. Amen. The bone of my bone and the flesh of my flesh. Mrs. Olushola. Amen. 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 You think I'm going to let you out? No way. Amen. 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 I'd also like to appreciate one of our guests all the way from London who has come also to, uh, to celebrate with us. Evangelist Moni Matinde, God bless you. Man. <laughs> God bless you. God bless you. I'd also like to appreciate our uh, the second half of Pastor McDonald, the wife of Pastor McDonald. Please, every put our hands together for the wife of Pastor McDonald. Amen. Amen. My own very special pastor. Amen. Amen. My own special pastor. The pastor of my church, AICC in Germany. Let us put our hands together, Pastor Tunima Idi. Hallelujah. Amen. Let us put our hands together for our own friend, one of the directors of Strong Tower International, uh, for, the, for the name of Mrs. Jane Monica Schmidt. Amen. It's a Dutch name. I almost caught myself. Amen. 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 So, like the goal is for Scrum to International, there are a group of people who have come together to look at various challenges in the body of Christ, in the society in general, and to propose solutions in the areas of administration, customer service, health. In every area of life, we have come to see solutions. How we can use the wisdom of God amen, to make every area work through the knowledge of the power of God. Amen. And to do so, we have identified three main. Excuse me. Um, the projector is supposed to be on board. We can go for the projector. Amen. Amen. To do so, we have three main factors to carry out our, our research, to do our own homework. We are, we, are, we are using our three main core principles, the principles of excellence, the principles of by sound by biblical knowledge, and the principles of integrity Amen. to carry out this function. We have been able to identify, we have been able to identify that to stand out in whatever you do and care, you need the knowledge of God. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. We need to stand out with the knowledge of God, with the standing out knowledge of God. That is why we have put together 
a group of different courses, Amen. different courses from different backgrounds, ranging from ministry, from theology, from art, from science, and very soon we are going to be hearing from one of our one of our uh, departmental head concerning how we are going to go about this project. But I'm just here to give a brief introduction concerning what we are going to be doing. Now, we realize that for one to also succeed in its own way and its own criteria, apart from the knowledge of God, we also need passion. We also need passion. We also need passion in whatever we do. We need passion to succeed. We need passion to succeed. While we're putting up this lecture together, and we're praying, the Holy Spirit said to us, passion is a spiritual currency that we need to have to be able to run the race successfully. Amen. Amen. It's the spiritual currency that we need to have so that we can run the race successfully. And when he gave us that option, we went ahead to define passion as. Please, if you, if you can write it down, please write this down. It's going to be very important. We were able to define passion as putting God first in all you do. Sorry, we are going back to school. It's a summit. That's the P. The A is accountability. Accountability. In all you do. That's the P. The A is accountability. The Bible says, six falls the kingdom of God and his righteousness. And every other thing that we added onto. So that's where the idea comes in when we're putting this <coughs> institute together. Seek God first. When you put God first, every other thing will automatically align. If you know where you are going. And you know, where, you know what God has called you to do. Yeah. So that's why we put the P as putting God first in all you do. And the A is accountability. You need to be accountable to God and to man, yeah. not to God alone. You yeah. need to show yourself pure. Ooh, Jesus. You need to show yourself pure Come in on. all ways and in all areas. Come on. Your ways need to be right with God and your ways need to be right with man. Come on. You can't tell God one thing and tell man another thing. Mm. You have to have a standard. Yes. So this is why we said A is accountability. <coughs> and the first S in that passion is saved. We need to be saved. We need to be transformed from the kingdom of darkness to the kingdom of light. To be able to enjoy this God-given ability and talent. To be able to identify this talent. And to be able to tap into this talent. We need to be saved. We need to be that kingdom that God has called us to be. So that we can hear from God from the original. We can hear from who has created us for this race. So that we can run the race successfully. So that is why we call the first place and passion saved. We need to be saved. Amen. The second passion is the second S is season. Yeah. Hallelujah. 